So guys, we are here in Leipzig. Forget my pronunciation in Germany. Behind me is the St. Thomas Church, where Johann Sebastian Bach most worked most of his life. I'm gonna go and check it out. The St. Thomas Church or the Thomas Kirche is a Lutheran church in Leipzig, Germany. It is associated with several well-known composers such as Richard Wagner, Felix Mendelssohn Bartholdi, and especially Johann Sebastian Bach, who work here as a music director. There has been a church at the current site of the Thomas Kirche at least since the 12th century. Foundations of a Romanesque building have been discovered in the choir and crossing of the current church. It served as a market church. At first, it was a three-aisled pillar basilica without a transept, which was closed in the west by a broad tower, extending over all three naves. A patron saint has not been handed down. Perhaps it was the evangelist Saint John. In 1213, the church was handed over as the Collegiate Church of Saint Thomas by the Margrave of Meissen Dietrich to the Augustinian Monastery of St. Thomas, which he had founded. This monastery later became the core of the University of Leipzig. Due to the new function as a monastery church of a canon's monastery, a choir in the early Gothic style was added to the east of the church, which was consecrated in 1218. In 1217, the Minisinger, or Troubadour, Heinrich von Murugen gave the church a relic of St. Thomas as he entered the Order of Canons after a trip to India. In 1355, the Romanesque choir was changed to Gothic style. Following an inflow of wealth into Leipzig from the discovery of silver in the Ore Mountain, the Romanesque nave was demolished and replaced in 1482-96 to by the current late Gothic Hall Church. In 1355, the church was repaired, nevertheless, it fell into disrepair. In 1412, the church tower collapsed. It was not restored until a half century later. The oldest preserved bell of the church, the Gloriosa, was rung on September 14, cast in 1477, and bears incised drawings by N. Eisenberg. Under the provost J. Falkenhayn, the nave was rebuilt from 1482. The city hall had to be moved several meters to the west. The current building was consecrated by Tilo of Trota, the bishop of Merseburg, on April 10, 1496. The tower was rebuilt in 1537, repaired in 1671, and raised to its present height in 1702 by the master mason Gregor Fuchs. Chapels added in the 17th century and a waiting room along the northern front of the nave with two stairways were removed at the end of the 19th century. During the Protestant Reformation, the church was converted from a Roman Catholic to Lutheran. The reformer Martin Luther preached here on Pentecost Sunday in 1539. The monastic buildings were demolished in 1541 following the monastery's dissolution. The Baroque marble altar in the choir room was donated in 1721 by the mayor Jacob Born and his widow and executed by Hermann and Fossetti. During the neo-Gothic reconstruction of the church in 1880 to 89, this altar was removed. Only the crucifix of the central part made by C.F. Lovelt remained and was attached to a pillar opposite the pulpit. The composer Johann Sebastian Bach was choir director of music at this church from 1723 until his death in 1750 and taught at its affiliated school. A statue of him by the Leipzig sculptor Karl Seffner stands next to the church was dedicated in 1908.
Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart played the organ at the church on one of his European tours in 1789. In 1806, the church served as a munition depot for the French army. During the Battle of Leipzig, the Thomas Kirche was used as a military hospital. Richard Wagner was baptized here on August 16, 1813. In 1828, he studied piano and counterpoint at the church. Most of the Baroque internal trappings of the church known to Pak were removed to a Gothic revival renovation from 1884 to 89. It was redesigned in neo-Gothic style under Constantine Lipsius. The current west facade with the apostle portal was created. During this time, the church also received a romantic sour organ on the west gallery which is still there today. On December 4, 1943, the tower was damaged in the Allied bombing raid on Leipzig, requiring repair. The authorities demolished the Johann Kirche, also damaged by the bombs. The remains of Johann Sebastian Bach were moved from there to the Thomas Kirche in 1950. In the 20th century, sulfur emitted from nearby coal mines and other pollutants in the atmospheric air caused deterioration of the exterior stonework and statuary and even of the interior Gothic paintings. In addition, the roof structure suffered from damage due to insects and moisture. For these reasons, the church was listed in a 2000 World Monuments Watch by the World Monuments Fund. Repairs were swiftly undertaken with financial support from the fund and from the American Express. Repairs of the church in 1961-64 to also attempted to emphasize the Gothic Hall Church character of the building. Another renovation followed in 1991. A statue of Felix Mendelssohn, who lived in the city from 1835 until his death in 1847, was dedicated on October 18, 2008, when it was re-erected opposite the St. Thomas Church on the occasion of the year of his 200th birthday. The original statue was designed by Werner Stein, was first dedicated on May 26, 1892. It had been located on the east side of the Gewan House until November 9, 1936, when it was taken down by the Nazis because of the composer's Jewish background. Thomas Kirche is also known for its boys' choir. With its 800-year history, it is one of the world's most renowned boys' choir. Since its foundation in 1212, the choir has been fostering and performing sacred music. It is also Leipzig's oldest cultural institution. During the Reformation, after the St. Thomas Monastery was closed, the choir was placed under the patronage of the city in 1543. The church remains the major location for its choir's appearances. As the most important ambassador for Leipzig's musical tradition and back heritage, the choir regularly gives guest performances in great international concert halls and holds a central position in Leipzig's music scene. So now, let us see some of the things worth seeing inside the church.
St. Thomas Church stands for the Evangelical Lutheran Parish of St. Thomas and its 4,900 members. As a minority church, it is facing the challenge of interreligious coexistence while living up to its mission to spread faith, its social responsibility, and its more than 800-year tradition. All of this is achieved by remaining true to the biblical message through the power of prayer through the deed of the righteous. In the past years, St. Thomas Parish had adapted to the changed condition and chances of church work in the city. It has helped shape the profile of Leipzig as the one and only back city in the world. In his universal language of music, Johann Sebastian Bach is the excellent translator of the faith in Jewish Christian tradition. The parish has set up private ways of funding and within three years, it raised almost 6 million euros in private donations to pay for the complete restoration of the church. Thomas Kirsch will continue to stand the test of time because within its vaults lies one of the world's most famous and beloved music composer. Alright guys, that's it for the history of the Thomas Kirsch. Until next time, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. Bye! So guys, if you like our videos, please subscribe to our channel. And feel free to comment. Hit the bell, hit the bell, hit the bell, hit the bell. Come on guys, hit the bell. For notifications. And don't forget to share. And like.